being defended. Now these two gentlemen, uh, no stranger to the cages all over Michigan for quite some time now. And these two came up with a concept that they defend about once every year. And this belt go, you know, basically it's the uh, cancer sucks belt because there's several different types out there that are horrible, that rob us of life day after day, year after year, family members, friends, and the like. So, the challenger, this will be a grappling contest, scheduled for two rounds, if it's tied after two, they go to three, and the submission ends it. So, challenger, making his way down to the steel, five feet, nine inches tall, weighing at 170, representing Exiled MMA, out of Cedar Springs, Michigan, Tony Stern! Michigan, the champion, Bob Mazzano! Ha, 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 ha. 
You don't want another highlight! <laughs> Good fight. Good fight, man. All right, and now, again, let's give it up for these two. Doing this once a year for Cancer Awareness. And the tap comes. One minute, 35 seconds into the contest. Fatal by Triangle. And a new Cancer Sucks champion, Tony Stern! <laughs> hey, Tony, come on now. Anytime somebody makes a grappling match entertaining, I gotta get an interview. You know, because everybody knows that that can be a crowd killer if it's not youngsters. That's all right. Sometimes it just has to be done. But, you know, you guys both, you know, no strangers to the cage, but also no strangers to good and important causes within, around our industry, throughout the state. You know, why don't you, you know, tell us a little bit about how this came about and then even some of the other organizations that you guys are so passionate about helping with your own shows and through all these shows throughout Michigan, Tony. First of all, I'd like to thank all you guys for coming out here. Uh, big, big shout out to Jeremy and Melissa. Uh, Bob is on over here. You know, people come into the cage, we have opponents. I met Bob five years ago. Four or five years ago, right here, in this cage, we were supposed to fight. This is my best friend. This is my, my brother. Uh, Last year, uh, I'm a promoter too. We do benefits. It's different when you're actually in the cage doing the benefit. Uh, we started this belt. Harold was part of this too. Uh, for cancer. Um, and they had a show last year for uh, Kit Cancer, I believe it was called, with Jerry and Melissa. We both, uh, Bob and I, have had some near and dear uh, cancer stuff to us, as, as probably a lot of you guys have. So Harold, Bob, myself, uh, we came up with this North, North, and South, um, the belts. Bob beat me last time by sheer luck. <laughs> uh, but I, you know, we do, we do some, we do this for, for our own uh, competitiveness. Um, this, this, ten minutes out of the day doesn't seem like much, but it's our little give back, you know, to people upstairs watching. Uh, Dave, you're a part of our, our my show is down south, down state. Everybody, you know, you, everybody has somebody that's had something. As fighters, this is a little token that we're doing for them. I do have one question for you, Tony. How do people be exiled? I know. I know. No, this is something that's very near and dear to both of our hearts. I mean, this is something so we can get back to the community, get back to MMA. Everybody that's, 90% of people have lost someone from some sort of cancer. What else can we do as fighters and role models than to show that we do care about the community and everything else? So that's why we did it, and now I just have to kickbox you and knock your head off. Thank you. Thanks, guys, and again, heck of an exhibition. We've got a new champion again, Tony Stark. <laughs> 